Mr. Lions Club. Yes. You're on. I am. It says public address to the board and Lions Club. <laughs> Mayor, if you want to step out in the front here, this is all about you. It's all about you. That's what Thompson. Can I charge the city for every word I ask? <laughs> sure. <laughs> I don't have to kiss you or something there. <laughs> Not this week. <laughs> Mr. Mayor, uh, proclamation in recognition for, the, for Mayor David Norman. And here's where as Ava Lions Club was chartered in 19, was a charter member at the time it was founded. Although David Norman is not a member of the Lions Club. His roots in his community are strong and he shows a commitment to helping others. Whereas the Ava Lions Club has a model, we serve and look for new members who share the same passion with the community. Whereas 82 years ago, whereas the Ava Lions organization is based on the principle of good government and good fellowship and they take an active interest in the civil, cultural, social, and moral welfare of the community. Whereas the Ava Lions Club would like to recognize Mayor David Norman for his showing support for the local organization and recognizing that the Ava community still needs people who have a passion for serving others. Now therefore, I, Burley Lofton, President <laughs> of the Board of Directors of Aldermen, <laughs> Of the city of Ava, Missouri, I do here, hereby proclaim the 26th, March 26th, 2019, as Mayor David Norman Day. And I thank you. Mayor. Buddy was the mayor. And I went out to the country club and they blacktopped the road going around the country club, the circle. So when I had a chance to talk to Buddy, I said, say, Mayor. When did the city start blacktopping private property? He stroked his mustache. <laughs> well, he said, I'll tell you. When I have somebody in town that I'm showing around and I want them to see things that are impressive, the country club is one of them. And he said, I come out here and I drive that circle with somebody who might be a prospective merchant of some kind. And he said, I want the road to look nice. And I said, thank you very much. <laughs> so it got, it got a coat of hot mix many years ago, but that's why. We and it still, hasn't, it still hasn't lost its importance, both of you, for, in, in that respect. It is, it is something, it, it's one of the things that we need to show off when we're showing somebody. And I had somebody today. We have a new, <clears throat> we have a new gentleman who took Joe Koloski's place at the U.S. Forest Service, and I made an attempt to meet him, and we went out to eat lunch. We've been all over the place today. That's one of the places we went today. Thank you. So thank you. it's an important place. We appreciate that, and we thank you for the efforts, especially last August when we had our our, our storm come through, and the effort the city put in. Yeah, the street. So, so those crews, for those crews worked hard. They did. They did work hard. hard. They worked so hard and cleaned Boy, the you had a mess. And we thank you. Thank the council for what you've done there. Yeah, we can't you. say enough about what you're doing out there. Yeah. We are so grateful and thankful. Thank you, Lionel. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. thank you very much. Do you have something, Bertha? Yes. Yeah, I want to. Can, can you ride one more time? Can you stand just for a little bit? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that old. <laughs> I'm glad you have a one. This is, this is a presentation on behalf of the, the, the alderman and, and the city employees. This is a the key to the city, presented to David Norman. They thought it, everything looked good and going the way it was supposed to. Man, it's going up fast. So um, we we'll pay a third of it once the uh, we pay the third of it. The other third will come with when they wrap it, and then the, the last one upon approval. So we pay the third of it. Uh, Gosh, it looks big, too. <laughs> but it's 40 by 100, so it is pretty good size. Mm -hmm. 
I have not heard anything on the Lower Park bathroom project yet. I, I really expect this week, and I thought maybe last week, to get a final drawing on the plans. And um, so that's coming. We haven't decided for sure where we're going to put it. Um, but that won't take long to do that. We'll get two or three people down there and, and the architect. Be sure it's not in the floodplain. And even even if we decide to put it in that one spot, probably not a bad idea to raise it up a couple of feet. And you get ready to do it, it might be the, the dirt's not suitable anyway. It might have to haul something in anyway, so we'll just have to see. So that's that's still there. I had, a, I had two guys come to see me, Mike Gardner and Jerry Carter. I don't know if any of you ever knew Gene Gardner at Souter. This was, uh, this was his son. Jerry Carter, evidently, uh, from what they said, has handled the internet for Gainesville and a lot of Ozark County. So they've been there for, he's been there for 20 years. They're wanting to come in and put an antenna up on the, uh, maybe one or two of the towers, which was all right. I mean, I, we, we don't normally object to that. Uh, I did not entertain the idea of switching any of the, what we've got over at this point. It was such a job to get internet out to our sheds, and it's, everything's working today. <laughs> What's the name of that the other company? Total High Speed. Total High Speed. Uh, sometimes it's been difficult to work with, but if anything happens, we'll have somebody else that we can use. Of course, what they really wanted to do was offer that service to the city in lieu of putting the antenna in, but that's it's kind of like changing your long distance service. You know, I just I actually didn't want to do that right now. Um, anyway, um, I, had, I had given him a price for the, you know, I told him we were looking at $125 a month. For, for, and that, that would include more than one tower. They wanted to do that. So I don't know what they're going to do, but I just wanted you to know that that's, their name is Viacast Wi-Fi. And I hadn't heard of them. Um, but no reason why I would have. So, anyway, I've been contacted by it. So they may come in and may provide another internet service for the area. We, we've done the QT pod, we've talked about that. The fire station, on the inside, the back door doesn't fit exactly right, and I've called them about that. I got a hold of Jason Bewley today, Burley suggested we put an awning over the back door because it blew water in around it. And Jason Julie's going to put um, an awning over the back and it'll be black to make Tom happy. And so we had that to do. We had the keys changed, the back door and the middle door and the front door are all keyed the same. The only key that's different is the one down on the south end where you would go in to do weights, that kind of thing. Several people had a key to get in that side. Fire department, police, sheriff's department all had keys to get in. Greg Nasip's got a little bit of pain, about four hours worth of pain to do in the hallway between them. All of the, all of the tile is down. The, the bowling around the edge is down. They're buying a new uh, the, the bathroom's been completely redone. I'm going to put a new toilet in there. It looks pretty darn nice inside, I tell you, if you get a chance. And if you want to go see it and it's locked up, come by. I'll get the key. We'll go over and look at it. These, these two guys, we ran into each other today, so they've seen it. And uh, it looks nice. Um, let's see. Court Need a motion to approve the court docket. Motion, motion to approve the court docket. Second. <clears throat> Somebody second. Yeah. yeah no. Okay. All in favor. Aye. 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 See, we didn't. Did we have anything? Nothing. Don't believe we. Uh, I just asked it. Nothing. 
Uh -huh. I don't need to go. Well, as it turned out, we didn't have it. Okay. And if there's no further business, gentlemen, this meeting is adjourned. Thank you very much. That wasn't a record. No, no, not even close. Not even close. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Seven minutes is going to stand a long time. <laughs>